Hey, Flame here, and welcome back to another CJ the Champion reaction. Today, we're reacting to Tommy Pickles and the Legend of Ooga Booga. Obviously, it's not Tommy Pickles, it's Pickles, the, the stupid caveman guy from Baki. I have not seen Baki. Uh, I saw CJ's uh, Yojiro Hama, right? Yujiro Hama's uh, vid. About him being uh, a walking Air Force, him being a straight menace, pip smacking his wife and stuff, breaking her back in front of his son, whooping his son uh, on the same night. Yes, I saw that vid. And now I'm gonna see this. Pickle. Why is this called Pickles? I don't know that he's a caveman. Yeah, looks like Jesus, bro. I look like him, but with long hair. I mean, I used to have long hair. Yeah. Hey. Mm. Yeah. Gummo, gummo, no. Yeah, oh, what? Cuts off now? No. Gather Fill in the and leave yeah. Space hey, turn the back on. Human, today is a very special day because he's today married to a white a woman. I'm just kidding. Okay, I gotta stop with the boondocks. Yes, I know. This is fucking bonkers. Mm -hmm. Sound off the SOS alarm. Yeah, I don't know. He's a caveman. Menace. I, I know and I don't spell. know I if the, if there's a correlation. So but anyways, uh, let's just go ahead and get to the chase. And the Hanmas. That's the thing I don't know. There is a no, correlation. Not that type of pickle. <laughs> Tommy uh, Pickles. The dinosaur slaying butt ass Whoa, naked wait. caveman. Did he choke uh, out a, uh, a velociraptor? The dinosaur slaying butt ass naked caveman. This guy is a problem. This man is a yeah, He's like the dude savage. from this Dr. Stone. That is I forgot the, the strongest human. Exhibit for this or the exhibit strongest high schooler, whatever his name is. Push and pee. Uh, before we get started, disclaimer. If you've not seen that new season no, of Baki, I have not. Uh, and I don't care. Do I plan on watching it? I don't know. Cause, but if you don't care. Because <laughs> um, exhibit Baki's he redheaded. I'm redheaded. So I got to rep my boy. So I don't know. Maybe. To exhibit P. Push and pee. Study of a primitive Bro, those pickle. quads. To be quite frank. Got his attack. <laughs> I mean, if you really think about it, he really did. Bro's a good 65 million years old. Oh, yeah, he daddy. Gauge. No, he and more than guilt. <laughs> was found in the present day, which basically is a new world. Yeah, yeah don't. There is a very long if something is ice or nigga, so we might as well just sealed the away. Or, whoa. Scientist right here. You're a victim. Mm. He's the one that let. No, let me guess. He's the one that. I need a number. Let me guess. He's the one that's like, hey. So he's Let's a part of the wake team him of up. scientists with literal Albert Einstein. Einstein? His body. Now, this idiot right here is the catalyst to all the bullshit. Because he uh, said, well, I mean, why didn't we just revive him, Doc? I mean, what's the harm in that? And, of course, Albert Einstein was like, like bro, you're a numbskull. You're out of your damn mind. Have you not bro, seen Power Rangers Dino Thunder? Don't wake up the caveman. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Cut it was dope. But like, yes. So persistent with it. So about 90 this days. Baki, not Power Rangers. Is still not woke up. So the scientists Let me guess. Mad and he's smoking he on like, the job. That's crazy. Stupid, primitive caveman. What a fucking failure. Then bro dropped his cigarette ash. Yeah. And after this, mm -mm. bro was having yeah. a meat beat yeah. with a damn Playboy <laughs> magazine. Bro, we're her, 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 her yeeks out? Wait, wait, first of all, you dirty ass nigga. Biddy's well, still looking at magazines. My nigga, you the primitive one. If you don't True. get a damn phone. So then this man or use the Mac the or the laptop like, desktop, whatever. He is a Snickers. I'm craving some steak. So this idiot gets the bright idea to go to the back and fry up some T-Rex corpse. Yeah. So while this man is frying up his steak and slathering some of that A1 sauce on that motherfucker, his Bro, how will like, that meat even, even do? I mean, it was ice for millions of years, so I don't know so if it's this man is how much preserved it will be. T -rex. He looks behind him. And this seven foot big ass Bro, man bare cheeks out. Looking at him like, Wait, hold up. Get a bite. Hold up. Look. Same level. That's crazy. Wait, is he actually seven foot? At him like, Can I get a bite? Bruh. And he just grabs the His nails. So yeah, uh, crazy. Shifting up in there. Does that man pickle smell what he was cooking and came back to life? Mm. But I guess that wasn't enough because he started looking at bro like a snack. So bro started shitting bricks. He was saying, Hey, 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 back the fuck. 
And let me guess, he, he goes, Jun, Jun. Whoa, he's already behind him. But that man got straight point blank hit markers. Nico looked at them little bullets like, what is this? Never mind. With the force of a gun, he basically shot, bro. And to make matters worse, the nigga pissed himself. Yeah, like that dude from the jails. Started using them as a damn shake weight. Damn. Yeah, sir. Doing his his tribe chant. Ooga booga, ooga booga. He got up and started walking like he done took like ten shots. Damn. This man was this man Antonio Brown levels of CTE. But by the grace of God, this man seals him away. But naked. Later on, this man done called the cops and everything. But he started telling them, Oh no no no, this ain't enough. Call the National Guard. Call the goddamn military. But this man started looking at him stupid. He was like, Sir, calm down. He's a caveman. So unless that motherfucker's King Kong, I think. Bro, I'm waiting for him to. To come out and just snap his neck. Speed now. A whole blast open through the wall, and this man pickle looking thirsty as hell. So yeah. He Bro, he lifted up a car. The the street fighter in this. Oh, hell no, this above my pay grade. Put five stars on this nigga. Call the national guard. Call the military. So they brung out the whole military. They even pulled uh, out the uh, same uh. damn mecha suit from the yeah, Avatar movie. Jax? That man pickle wasted no, no time. He destroyed the mech in one hit. And he had my brother in here panicking. He was like, oh, hell no. Don't pay me enough for this shit. I should have quit. And that man got sent in the spin cycle and just went flying back. And then that man just proceeds to decimate the entire army. I ain't gonna lie, bro. If I'm witnessing this shit, I'm calling the president and mm -hmm. I'm like, hey, what is he gonna do? Oh, okay. Maybe. There's only one way to reason with this savage. This man strike. Get another him. savage. But booty naked sat down with this man and said, Okay, let's see what we're working with. <laughs> Therapist. Oh. Nice guy. Hey. Pickle was off to Japan. So when Pickle arrived, communication Japan, is key. This man commits a very horrendous action. And um, this is gonna lead into victim two. Women? God, the Fucking news reporter. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and, had a feeling. Uh, he clapped. Her? Oh, Peace mode. Souls. Roll the clip. Breaking news, breaking news. A primitive man found in America now arrives in Japan. Ladies Why am Japan of all places? Right. I'm your host, Donovan Barnacle, and I'm Clarence. Dick what does that dude Lord? look like? The dude see, from the Persona 4 from the TV. And has just arrived in the, the one that hooks airport. you up with all that good Multiple stuff. Yeah. That this man is all the way from the Jurassic period. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Our crew is live right now. Let me guess. He hits the reporter with the I like you. And I want you. Donovan, that motherfucker is huge. It looks like Tarzan just hopped out the screen. And now we go live to our reporter. This is yours. Tiffany, is it possible to get an bro, whoa, Tyrannica. That's that's crazy. And, um, Gear five, and gentlemen. Um, oh Michael wait, never mind. Committed the horrible act of uh. Okay, <laughs> right then and there, that's crazy. Okay, never mind. And At first, that day, I thought she he was gonna go squish her head, like a like a grape. At first, that was like, okay, that's not that bad. Oh, never mind. That's crazy. I want to see it again. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> God, cut this shit now. I hit my mic. I'm sorry. And on that day, Pickle violated a news reporter. Yeah. On the news. Dear God, somebody please. Like, stop was his, this nigga. his pants were so stolen? Oh, never mind. Incident, I should just not. Every single fighter in the Baki verse wants to fight this nigga. They broke yeah, into they're the broke in. And everything. These niggas is horny. I mean, yeah, pull up. Nah, but before this happened, that's I'm me. Sorry, I got no, I'm scared. That's my dad. Quick. How this man <laughs> in the base makes absolute no sense. This nigga walked up to the door, Just walked in, and everything in his sheer presence hypnotized all of them and made them start fighting each other. Bro, what? Like, Fuck a Sharingan. I don't need that shit. Bro, what? I'm gonna get you so it's a sheer presence. Don't what? Don't just put the entire Uchiha clan on fraud alert. 
Look at bro, he's punching himself. Then this is like Pokemon when you get hit with confusion. Yourself instead of me, so you're forgiven. Then slices the gate open with, with his, his hand. hands. This man Yujiro is the most disgusting nigga I've ever seen on a screen. So back to where we were at earlier. This man Pickle did not pay any yeah. attention until the boogeyman himself came. So then Yujiro just decides to break all laws yeah. of physics and forces himself through, through the glass. glass. Nigga, what the fuck is and watching? through his clothes. Back hell no, nah, bro. Whoever wrote Baki, you are off a of perk, my nigga. Wait, hold up. That remind me of this of the and from Pokemon Black and White, where you go uh the third gym, the ink uh bug type gym, where you walk through the honeycomb thingies. Yeah. Hey, it reminds me of that. You want a bro fist? So then these two have the manliest fist bump of yeah. all time. Yeah. Pickle was like, yeah. You big T Rex. Then Yujiro flipped bro and put him on his ass. And he mm. was astonished. He was like, holy shit. I actually had to use 1% of my power. So after this mm. incident, they decide to move Pickle to an arena. And while he was in this arena, they threw a bunch of animals at him. Bear? He flees into our next victim. A Siberian tiger. Yo, bro, bro, why is this ba bear? Why is this tiger? tiger that hasn't eaten up. For five days, but it did not matter at all. <laughs> yeah, Pickle but. got up and looked at that thing like, "Ooh, you look tasty!" It pounces on the tiger and breaks his spine. Mm. Bro, made that nigga bear the hug. Sea. My God, somebody get Peter on the line. I actually feel bad for this guy. That is a terrible way to go out. And then bro, out it. Raw. He is not human. So then Pickle decide to run the gauntlet of fighters. So with that, we moving straight into victim four. Uh -huh. You're a victim. You're a victim. This man Ritz. I'm, but I'm not a rapper. Embarrassed. Pickle was playing with this man like he just got a new toy for Christmas. Yeah. So this man jumped in the ring. Pickle wasted no time. He bitch slapped him. Damn. To the wall. That should have been your Dude first sign. Put him on his ass five seconds into the fight. And you could that see should the have been that first sign. Face. He's like, oh God, I think I'm fucked up. Think, <laughs> nigga, you done fucked up. Yeah. You're trying to fight a big ass caveman. You but he's still going to keep going, Dude, ain't he? Who starts landing strikes. Bro thought he was him for a moment. But Pickle found his face and mm. knocked him out cold. And then Pickle picks him up with tears in his eyes. Pile driver. Nah, I'm just kidding. For the meal, Eat him. Right out of his shoulder. Oh my God, he's a cannibal. And then he took another bite. Oh Lord, have mercy. We about to start smoking on that red suit pack. And just look at him chewing. Bro is crying in joy looking like. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, the flavors are melting on my tongue. I mean, he is a caveman. Oh Lord, red suit pack it up, bro. We don't know how what uh, K-Mans did back in the day, a but that's of Kung Fu, crazy. A of this verse He's <sighs> big. Oh, never so mind. It got so bad that this man had to abandon all of his technique and started running at this man, rolling punches that's and trying. crazy. And punches like a child having a temper tantrum. And that man Pickle was looking at him like, what's wrong with you? It slaps him on the ground. Damn. No, no, no. Hit him bro, twice. His ass be so bad. Bro, start his seat. Same move. Force ghost. Bro. Bro got hit so hard, his soul came out of his body. But I guess his soul gave him a pep talk because bro actually knocked him down. But it was what? all too late. Pickle jumps up and okay. lands on all fours. Oh, and no. Turns into fucking Roman Reigns. He lines this man up. For the spear. Sit bro all the way back to the locker room. KO. Nah, bro. It's a charge attack. Fuck out of my ring. Do you think charge yeah. attacks are jokes? Well, they ain't. He well, ate him. It's time to grub. Wait. And that day, pickle lady's leg. Okay, his leg. Bro said it's time to grub. And on that day, Retsu lost the leg. And he would have became a whole mill if Albert Einstein ain't tranquilize him. But look at your dumb ass. Now you got a peg leg. Oh, peg leg ass nigga. Shouldn't have been so horny to fight a caveman. So after Pickle decided to make this man an amputee, Pickle went out for a night of fun. And Whoa, this he's still in Tokyo? Random nigga 47. You're a victim. You're a victim. So as we can see, but I'm not random nigga 47 is out here on a nightly stroll looking like he on the Yeah, bird. oh, his he ears though. Like, home does home. he have cauliflower ear or what? He know? That he was the one being hunted by another man on the prowl. Mm, Bude. This man decides to go in a dark alley and take a leap. This man put this trying to snatch. Yeah. He's using the garbage bags as camouflage. And bro just 
got oh. assassinated Vietnam style. And bro came out and took his whole fit. Oh my God, look what he did to them jeez, nigga. Open them up. I mean, bro, he's seven foot tall, ain't he? Them hoes is folded. So after Pickle committed the taboo of creasing a man's jays, yeah. he ends up pulling off probably one of the greatest feats in anime history. So the whole block is, is walking, pregnant. He no, I'm just kidding. Crossing the road with the red light. And if you don't look both ways before you cross the street, I mean, if this is Japan, would send you to another He world. stopped truck <laughs> Okay, never mind. He didn't stop trucking. He's gonna whoop. break the brakes off of a truck, <laughs> ain't he? Well, back in now, town, bro, you were everywhere. Never thought I'd do that before. It's an honor. Now, what should we name your isekai? I was a caveman reincarnated into another world. Yeah. Perfect. Enjoy your trade my get. Trade my get before it becomes a thing. <laughs> Truck. And ladies and gentlemen, documented on that day in the streets of Tokyo, Truck Coon was slain and eaten alive. Mm. So after Pickle slayed the Isekai God, this man Katsumi sent a bunch of his goons to spin back for Retsu. Then Hanayama's big Yakuza ass to Bro, the this guy again? Bro, how the hell are you 19? So Hanayama decided to test Pickle's gangster while holding this knife with their bare hands, but his efforts were futile. Pickle sends his 300 pound man child flying. And then look at this idiot right here. Bro uh -uh. really punched him thinking he gonna I do mean, something. Pickle grabbed that man's arm and break it. it. Yeah. And this bum looking like a Batman Gotham crook looking like <laughs> it's the bat. So he started throwing punches, but Pickle hey, hit with hey, a signature hey. move. Booga, booga, so Ow! Stops Pickle from his eyes got no more souls. He finally decide to pull up for himself. So Pickle puts out his fist asking for a bro fist. So Baki reaches out. And Just he like his dad. The exact same move Yujiro did to him. Oh God, he's learning. And look at his smug ass face. Oh, hell no. Nah. But Baki was like, hell no. Nah. Hey, Roundhouse kick that mm. But Pickle ate this kick and looked at him and said, follow me. So later that yeah. night, he brings Baki back to the arena. And this man wasted no time. Bro, hit him with a booga booga kick. Mm. Exactly. Baki flying to the stage. Lord have mercy, he done made the main character a victim. You're a victim. Mm. So after Pickle added the yeah, main Yeah, why he dancing, bro? Victims, another man stepped up to challenge the blonde the dude. Man. Okay, never mind. Kasumi Orochi. Bro was determined to get it back in blood for Retsu. This man went on a devious oh, training. Oh no! And throw a punch over Mach One speed. They even rented out the this whole not gonna, Tokyo Dome. This is not so gonna go good. Go watch him fight this nigga. But little did they know, they were gathered for a public execution. Glover? So the fight starts and Katsumi already comes out the gate swinging. But that man Pickle took that like no 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 not today and kicks this man across. The really, that's how the thing with Bucky ended. That's crazy. And then Pickle does something absolutely terrifying. He takes the exact stance as his mask. Okay, never mind. Bro, I would quit right now. So Pickle comes in swinging. Yeah. With a nasty gut check and actually made this man drop to his knees. Pickle was like, Oh God, me so strong. He just slapped him in the face. Ooh, okay. But unfortunately Never mind. For Katsumi, I was hating on this guy earlier. With such great power. Because since bro is basically punching at the speed of sound, his body kind of can't handle it. Because he's mm. fucking up his hands. He so pulled the deck out. War of attrition. Basically to see how many blows Pickle could take before Katsumi kicks the bucket. So after hitting Pickle with his most powerful shot, he knocked him down, but his arm is just completely destroyed. Gone. Bone showing and everything looks like Yeah. So bro thinks he's won. Everybody in this motherfucker. Yeah, bro. His bones are out. Reality, Pickle was not knocked out. He was actually asleep. Sleeping. 
Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. I like that Einstein has just been witnessing everything. His energy because he knew bro was done for. Everybody in the arena was like, oh, Lord. Run. Lottie, Lottie, Lottie. Katsumi knew he was cooked. Bro basically said, well, I'm cooked, pickle. Okay, so he so started the bleeding him by using his dog belt. Ass. Pause. It's the old guy from the other one. And with that, Pickle took that man's arm. And I ain't gonna hey. lie, that's how you can tell Katsumi then lost all his brain cells. Bro was out here saying, oh, how do I taste Pickle? Do I taste good? Like, nigga, Is my pack cooking? Pause. About to bleed out. Hey. Just that. You about to become a whole four-piece combo. I mean, his that arm was already gone. So. I guess the blood counts as bad. Oh, well. But that man Pickle actually left. Bro said, nah, nigga, you taste like Raising Cane's. Damn. Left bro there. Well, I mean, Damn. At least he got off the hook for tasting like shit. So after Pickle took another body part from a fighter, he was about to commit the biggest violation of 2023. And ladies and gentlemen, the next victim on our list, the steroid god himself. Okay, never mind. Bro it's told blonde, Pickle, dude. go ahead, get your ass. <laughs> so Fuck his older brother. Okay, that charger was good. It was like, oh, what a natty punch. So then these two commit the biggest AO pause moment of 2023. Oh, they make this out. Jack said, you want to have a bite off? Did you pray today? What do you say, caveman? Come give daddy a big old kiss. kiss. Yeah, the make out. No bite off. Their faces are literally locked. But I guess Jack Smooch wasn't strong. Nah, but this not the part that's crazier. Look, they're all, they got their hands on the back of their heads. They're like, oh, like they're going deep in this. But I guess Jack Smooch wasn't strong enough because Pickle picked him up and started spinning him around like a helicopter and threw him across the ring. And this man, Jack, probably suffered one of the most grotesque Lost his jaw. I've ever seen in an anime. He bit off his tongue. His face. Oh, yeah. Okay, never mind. Bro made this nigga two face but horizontal. So that then Pickle lined up for the spear. But this man, Jack, said, I ain't going out like no bitch. Mm. He's throwing this man in the stands. Goes up in the stands. Oh, damn, bro. Damn, and counter. How by the grace of God. Dude was actually popping off. Ooh, that show you can. Off his ear. Okay. Yo, this man Jack got a blood for blood or something. But I can say this with no doubt, bro is truly a freaky frog. But this him piss pickle off to the max. Pickle hit this man with the most disgusting four piece combo. Bro goes in for the punch, takes Jack's hit. Ooh, okay. Ooga, ooga, uppercut. Ooga, ooga, Damn. 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 Damn! Yeah! Yeah! And that yeah! Man yeah! Shadow Room. Bro juggled not him and everything. Not only with a Mortal Kombat ripped the face he off. The emote on him. Nah, bro. <laughs> the yeah, bottom bro, face off. Loki, Loki, and broke the face. Go in on Jack to eat him, cause bro had a whole special move even when he was unconscious. Bro would have gave him the middle fingers. Finger. Again. Oh, but this is not the end of Jack, cause dude woke up out of the hospital and went back to the arena. Yeah, I same day. The determination, bro, took a bow and said, "Forgive me for uh leaving in the middle of our fight." Bro, kicked up. <laughs> so dude started constantly kicking Pickle in the face, giving him the feet and everything. This man must main jury. He is not yeah. making frog allegations. Yeah. So this man Pickle's primal instinct started kicking, and he started his mommy. running away. Bro was like, "Get this freaky frog like away Lee. from me!" But then he stopped and, and thought to himself, "Ooh, God, I'm being." Bitch right now, yeah, bro. you're running. Bitch. So he runs at him and hits him with the Daquan special. And hey, his ass. Oh my goodness. Folded. Beyblade. And it was over. Jack's dumb ass woke back right up in the hospital. Bruh. So this man Jack runs out. Try to go back at it again. again. But Baki was like, bro. Nah, stop, stop big bro. You're just going to get your ass whooped again. That's why dad only cares about me. Yeah. <laughs> And he ends up telling him that yeah. he picked him up after and the fight. Put him back him in the hospital. Of a building. Okay, never mind. His unconscious body so he could go back and eat his prey. And this man Jack was shook. This nigga was like, oh hell no, I really did get cooked. 
That's crazy. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we've reached the end of the road. Baki comes back to get Let's go. Round two, Baki. Let's go. Prehistoric menace. No. Go me. He put up the best fight. But oh my God, the damage he took was ridiculous. Pico jumped up all the way to the roof of the arena. Yeah. And dropped him on the back. back. Knocking this man unconscious. Then when he woke up, he figured out his internal organs were full. But I ain't gonna lie. Bro, that was a big fall. This entire fight. Bo hit him with a back slap. And his nigga ain't paid like his dad <laughs> ass with a bag and just continue to whoop his ass. Uh, that's funny. Was shook. Dude, he sent them flying in the stands. So while Bro, Bucky's if your spears are getting countered, armor, stop spearing. For this bullshit. I'm tired of this disrespect. Ooh, God, 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 God. Mm, okay. And this man started stepping on him. Hit him with a DK front spike. Stomping on that nigga at light speed. Then he uppercutted this man <laughs> to the roof. Bro was thinking in his head midair. Damn, I'm getting cooked. Then he yeah. Go into a roly poly, but this man Baki ended hey, up unlocking we, ultra we, instinct. We, we, we. Oh Lord, that nigga ain't having kids. Low blow. Low blow. This man Piccolo ain't having kids. Low blow. This man Piccolo ain't having kids. Nigga was on the ground hitting that Chun Li spinning bird kick. But <laughs> unfortunately for Baki, that uppercut to the dick sealed his fate. Oh. Uh, the dog was ready to be released. Now you see, Pickle already had that dog in him. But yeah. Now, the dog is off the leash. He ends up getting all his primal memories back. This nigga has gone full primal. This uh. is who Lever King wants to be, damn it. And this is his final form. The legend of Ooga Booga. Bro, his it shoulders and elbows. Looking like, oh my god. Why did I punch him in the dick? So they started beating the living shit out of each other. These boys was having a war. But mm. somehow, some way, Baki had him on the ropes. But this man, Baki, sold. Nigga sold the whole fight. Bro just walked up to him and said, hey, man, let's just throw hands till somebody get knocked the fuck out. And with that, they did. And to nobody's surprise, Baki got knocked the fuck out. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Nigga sold, bro. And with that, Pickle took no L's, and this wild beast is still on the run. Make yeah. help every single person in this universe. So yeah, that's that. Bro made it, but Push with stipulations. We're locking this savage beast in a cage. And he's but why he's got pickles up? 24-7 to prevent any more victims getting made a four-piece combo. Well, that's that. Until next time. Ta-ta! Okay. Okay, Crash Bandicoot. To be fair, I kind of, I thought, I thought more women were gonna be involved in this. I don't know why. I thought Pickles would be a super duper heinous man, and just start like women. I'ma get you, other women. I'ma get you. I doesn't do that. But I was wrong. Anyways, obviously the the link to the original video down in the description below. Go watch yourself. Go like yourself and support CJ the champion, please, and support me by liking and subscribing to me. See y'all the next reaction. Bye bye.